Greetings Candle Power Forum users. This is Mr. G-Man once again. Today I'm going to demonstrate the modularity of the Malkoff MD2 and MD4 systems. How they interchange parts and also how they go together. So first we have the MD2, a complete set. This is the original M60. We have the two mode switch ring which has a resistor and a little uh, contact plunger to make high and low mode. The MD2 host body and of course a pair of batteries. They are rechargeable in this case. So normally you can get any of the regular M60 size drop in modules and you can put it into the MD2 host. There's a neoprene rubber ring in there to provide a watertight seal the two mode switch ring goes in with the resistor facing in and the little contact tip I don't know if the camera can catch it but the little contact tip right there faces out because that's going to change modes by making contact on this okay you can zoom back out a little bit so with the resistor faced in we're going to fit that in there until we feel that it's turning. We don't want to cross thread it. Any good pair of needle nose pliers that are on the long side that you can fit in. And I'll turn this to face the camera once I get it in there. Right? That you can fit in there like this. Just use that to tighten it up. You make it snug. You're not torquing it down with a, a lot of torque but you're making it snug when it warms up it'll tighten up somewhat but you're making that snug in there to hold the module in place provide continuity through the ring All right I can cheat and do that so you do it by feel but it's in there it's snug right it's not rattling loose drop in two batteries facing forward tips facing forward the positive end facing the head of the module screw it together and you've got yourself a flashlight with high and low mode can you see that mr. cameraman okay so the other beauty of this is the Malkoff MD4 Wildcat. Soon there'll be an MD3 that'll be a little bit shorter. But right now this is the MD4 Wildcat. And the beauty of all of this is in the MD system is that you can swap heads and go. People have wanted to see this this is the MD2 Wildcat because it's a Wildcat head high low still works right high low still fully functional on an MD2 body soon there will be an MD3 body with a replaceable switch so here's the MD2 head on the MD4 body and again you got high and low mode right high low high low so if I had an MCE module in here, which is a, a high power module, draws about 10 watts of power, I could run it off the bigger MD4 with two 18650 batteries. All right, I'm going to switch these back. I'm going to try and be quick about it. And there we go. Two fully functional flashlights. And that concludes this portion of the testing.